Yo, what's going on guys? Shake it back, back more, my team. And this video, I'm just gonna talk to you guys because I've kind of realized something this year. Like this 2K, like at least for now, this time of me making this video, is actually really rewarding. I'm waiting for some pizza, the football game's even coming on too. Like today's a crazy day, today's awesome. But let me just get into why I think this 2K is really rewarding. Um, and it's because of the reward token section. This is changing the way my team is. And I actually really like it. Now, you can see there's 30 emeralds. Then you gotta move up to move up tiers. But you don't have to buy all 30. You can just buy 10 of them. And they're only three apiece. And again, I already have three tokens. And I really haven't even, like, played the game. <laughs> so you already get, like, a free emerald player to start out with, which is pretty dope. And there's some good ones in here, too, like Jared Jack, Robert Ori. These are guys you can use in Domination. And, like, they'll get buckets. Gary Payton, Darko, like, Morris Peterson. Okay, not, not too bad. World be free, Dennis Scott is a sharpshooter. Channing Fry too. Like, there's some good options here. Let's scoop this Dennis Scott, 82 overall. Again, for just some tokens, which are damn near free because you get them from playing the game and things like that. There you go. Ooh, the card looks crazy dope. But, um, yeah, and, like, uh, you can see a ton of people are already starting to redeem these and everything. 30, 24. So, uh, yeah. Now we only need nine more of these, and then we can start getting Sapphire players, too. And there are only six tokens for an 85 and again, for just playing the game, sometimes last week, last year, you had to, uh, you know, play weekly challenges for five whole weeks to get, you know, a Sapphire player. Whereas now, I mean, you can just do some stuff as just play a couple games of Domination, and boom, you can get yourself an Emerald. And then once you get that, you do that a couple times, you can get the Sapphires. Like, like, it's really rewarding. Look at Domination right now. So I haven't even unlocked the other tiers, but you do get five tokens for just beating five games. That's not bad. Token per game. Okay, cool. And again, you also get packs and players along the way. I think you get at least a silver player, maybe even a gold for each of these games as well. You get contracts too. Like, so you get all that normal stuff and you get the tokens on top, which is something we didn't have last year, which makes me, I don't know, it, it seems a lot more rewarding and I like it. Let's talk about the uh, collections too, which is another thing I always do, but like, I feel like sometimes when you do them, like, you don't get much in return. But, like, we check out these current NBA collections, and you get 20, 20 tokens back. That's a lot. 20 tokens. Again, that's a couple of Sapphire players. I mean, I think you would have gotten, like, what, a Ruby Historic last year? I think, I, I mean, depending on how much those are, you could still do that this year. And, like, you don't have to be stuck with one guy you don't want to use either. Like, you could wait and save them, and, again, you get some crazy cards once you start moving up and we come over the rewards like how much are the rubies rubies are 12 so like you get a lot more rewards than you would have in the past for doing a collection and you get to choose hey i don't want this guy i want scotty pippen right away right out the gate once you get the sapphires and the emeralds already done and because the, the collection rewards give it 20 you get those done pretty quickly like there is other ways to get tokens too like you can literally get them so many ways there's goals too um, oh, we just completed one, I think. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why is it flipping through? Whoa, what was that? I don't know what that was. It started doing it on its own, but 75 if you get this, but you won't be able to get this for a while because you need a player of the month card. You need to complete cover glide. So this one, we're not even going to look at because you can't do that right now, but like, uh, I'm sure this one seems pretty doable. Complete a schedule. That's already out. Win four different multiplayer challenges. You can't do that just yet. Win five matches, you can do that pretty easily. Do defeat the divisions and triple that. That's not that hard. Like, there are ways to get this shit. 15 tokens, again, for just doing stuff that you're pretty much gonna do no matter what. Like, you're gonna play the schedules and the challenges because they're better this year. I'm gonna play them. Like, you get tokens for just playing the game, and I feel like they're actually rewarding you to a decent amount. The only thing that's not really rewarding are these stupid daily trials. Um, they, they gotta re up the awards. Imagine if they gave us three tokens a day for this no you dunking or maybe three per trial that would be kind of nice and as i was saying you can get them in triple threat you can get them in multiplayer by playing this and then yeah again you get what five for think for beating the divisions in this too so there are so many ways and these are just little short quick mini games too all right i wasn't really trying to play right now fam i'm waiting on the pizza guy but like you can get a ton of different ways we got the ball drop to the raptors um, like, man, there's, there's a ton of different ways to play this year. It's crazy. So we're kind of stuck playing this game, but I think I've pretty much said what I need to say. I said what I said. This is how it's going to go. You're going to get reward tokens, and reward tokens are probably the biggest currency, I think, because I want to get that Pink Diamond, Paul Pierce, and all the other ones, and there also will be packs that you can buy, 
and things in the reward market. Ooh, that's not a good pass. Kawhi Leonard just snagged that. Forgot he was on the Raptors. I don't know if I like that. Ooh, good block. Oh, what? We can't give that up. But, but yeah, like, there's a lot of ways to get uh, rewards, and that's one of the reasons why I am really excited for this year. LeBron James, go to the basket. Come on, finish. Mavamo, no. Mo, baby. I got him for my starter pack, and he get buckets for me. Yeah, this is triple threat. This is actually against the CPU, and again, you can play this online. You can play this against the CPU, and I think as you move up through divisions, you get rewards, and I don't know if there's, like, a final end card. But, um, yeah, you get some pretty sweet stuff. Mo Bamba cutting. Mo Bamba finishing. Ooh, he's nice. Bruh, the Pizza Hut came. Look at it. Look at, look at it. Look at the Pizza Bro, Pizza Hut fire. So, yeah, uh, I think I'm just going to end the video here. But I'm going to finish this game. I'm going to chill out. But, yeah, I did want to just let you guys know. I'll get you guys some more gameplay of this mode in case y'all haven't seen it already. Uh, but, yeah. I'm gonna eat my pizza right now. I'm starving, man. So I'm trying to get y'all as many videos, but I uh, hope you guys just enjoyed the quick little tip video. And uh, sorry to cut it short, but I'm not even cold pizza fan. <laughs> I know cold pizza is pretty good. But we'll see how this is as the year goes on. But I assume um, that as the year goes on, like I'm hoping they'll keep adding stuff and adding rewards and more tokens and ways to get them. Because it looks like for now, they really are trying to get us tokens, and I like it. So yeah, peace out. And, uh, yeah, hopefully you guys understand this. And you really don't have to spend money on VC right now to get a decent team. Like, you really don't. Like, I'm not just saying that to say that. Like, I'm dead serious. So, yeah, it's kind of nice. Peace. <laughs> pizza. 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 <laughs>